going on everybody? I just wanted to give you all a quick teaser of a project I'm working on here. This is a Dell server. What am I doing with this Dell server? Well, I'm turning this into my workstation. I got 12 gigabytes of memory, spaced out triple channel among all three, all both uh, CPUs in this machine. I got dual redundant 870 watt power supplies in this unit. Um, I've got the heat guard. I've got the airflow go. I got the air dam off because well, I'm working on it right now. I just regreased these CPUs because I was having some heat issues. Um, I modified one of these things yeah I cut a I cut a slot in the end of one of these to allow it to accommodate a larger card instead of just the 8x so I can put a graphics card in here a bigger graphics card and then right here I've got a uh, just a GT710 uh, this is actually a special GT710 that's an 8x card so just a, instead of a 16x card I had a sound card in here, but the sound card I ordered was defective, so I've got to return that. And also, if anybody, anybody, has some R710 Dell hard drive sleds that they're willing to uh, donate, uh, direct message me and let me know, because I would love to get some real hard drive trays. The guy I bought this summer was supposed to give me three, and he gave me three. But look what he gave me. He gave me three fillers, not three hard drive trays. So that was a bummer. I kind of knocked him on eBay for that one. But uh, he got back with me real quick, and we got it fixed. I didn't leave a negative feedback. I left a good feedback because, you know, I paid about $100 for this system. So that was just a incredible steal. These fans, they're this system, you would think this thing would be so noisy. It's not. This thing is quiet. When it starts up, it's loud, but after it gets settled, it's very quiet. Until you pull the lid off. Um, the only thing that I'm having trouble with right now is the dual redundant power supplies and the compatibility with my um with small UPSs. I have to run this thing on a 1200 VA UPS. Uh, looking to actually go buy a 1500 VA UPS to replace my 1200 VA UPS. So anybody knows a good deal on a used 1500 VA UPS, I would be greatly appreciative of that. But here it is. This is what I'm calling the server to workstation build. Uh, I'm building the system for development, gaming, video production. Just because it has 12, it has eight physical CPU cores, 16 threads. Um, one of the biggest things, also, if anybody has some real cheap leads on X5680s and the LG1366 platform, let me know. I would love to get my hands on those for something under $100. Also, if anybody has any good leads for memory, I would love to push this thing to about 64 to 128 gigabytes of RAM. So, if anybody has any leads for any of that, please let me know. Um... Yeah, here it is. This I'm hoping by like April, May to actually submit this to be um, reviewed. I'm hoping to actually show this system off in such a way that I can win prizes with this system. Uh, one of the things I really like right now about this, one of the bad things about this as well, if I get one of these power supplies out of here. Both of these power supplies came like extremely dented. But it's okay if these start giving me trouble. Um, I know several server farms that have a bunch of these redundant power supplies. I can just call and say, hey, I need two power supplies. Let's sell them to me. And here's the other power supply unit. These power supply units are very clean inside. I was really happy to see that whoever owned this machine before me took good care of it. Yeah, here's the... Here's the system as a whole. I will do more videos on the system in the future. Thank you for watching.